What do you think is more attractive to a guy? A woman that is not promiscuous, not that intelligent, not college educated, but follows the lead and is fairly quiet? I mean, most women that are like that are not. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You didn't even hear the question. Go for it. And you're trying to talk. Listening. Oh, are you really? Wow. So, number two, again, number one, not college educated, (laughs) not necessarily the smartest girl, but quiet and submissive and not promiscuous. Let's say maybe one body counter a virgin. Or a girl that's cultured, educated, uh, has had 10 bodies and is uh, independent. Which one do you think most men would find attractive? And the latter person is more attractive they're both equally attractive they're both as equally attractive yes who do you think the man is going to go for i think generally don't use your ego invested Uh, i want you to give me an objective what do you think a majority of men would go for they'd go for the one that they can tell what to do so that's going to be the one that's less educated oh okay and not as traveled and cultured or whatever. Because so, you used that earlier. Yeah, as, yeah, as, yeah. And that's, that that's going to you... be your idea. Like a man who's actually high value is going to want someone who has those traits. They're not going to want a dumb little 18-year-old bitch who doesn't know how to do shit. Because that's not being coachable. Being coachable really? is bringing skills to the table mm-hmm. that can be utilized. No, it's not. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like you can't be like, hey, can you, my co- can you utilize my skills? No, no. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so who do you think who do you think is more likely to follow a man's lead? The girl that I described first or the girl that's second? If I have a man who is superior to me, can help me get on that level, can help me continue to grow, then he's gonna pick me. Because he doesn't have to train someone from a child. That wasn't a question okay, I asked. Repeat the, repeat the question. The question I asked is of those two women that I just described, which one is gonna be more likely to follow his lead? I mean it depends. The first woman. The first one because she doesn't know what she's it. doing naturally until yeah. she's lost a few men by not letting him lead and then you know better now yeah but which one is better the one that's lost a few men or the one that hasn't i think the woman that's lost a few men because she knows how to keep one now incredible the incredible. girl wow. you know, these, these girls that have no experience like what the hell is going on like wow. so what she's never sucked a dick and all that stuff now you get her home and she still can't suck when you train you can, and you still can't do her. other shit can too. Can you're, you're yeah. telling me you're when, tell- when you were young you didn't know, right? So when right. I coach you, right. so rather than right. go for 20 men, let one man coach you, you're good to go. Yeah, maybe. Look. Maybe. But I also have a friend who, Yo, I have a this? homegirl right now, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. She's been with one guy. Yeah. I feel so bad for her, right? Yeah. Because she tells me about this bedroom experience with a man that she's been with for years, and it's terrible. And she doesn't have nothing to compare it to. She just knows it's that not satisfying good. her. That's weird. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. She doesn't know what she likes. She doesn't know what she likes. She just knows she doesn't like it. But yeah. she doesn't have nothing to compare it she to. No experience. To be able to show him, like, okay, you're not doing it right. This is really how I like to be pleased. Like, there's a gift and a curse to that. Does she yes, tell a man, him that? A man wants a girl without a past, but it depends on she's living currently in her past and, and her past experiences. Like, like dicks. Like, if I was this girl then and I get with this guy now, I mean, I'm not promiscuous anymore. I'm not saying I have never been promiscuous, but I'm definitely not promiscuous now. Yeah, what are you crazy? Yeah, Yeah, what is going on here? The way I was, hold on, listen, the way I was when I was 18, 21, I I gave it up for nothing because I thought a man telling me he liked me. Listen to what I'm saying to you. Listen to what I'm saying to you. You're going, you're, no, I mean exactly what I'm saying. So I say this on any platform I'm talking to. So I'm not taking back what I'm saying. I stand on what I'm saying. And I believe what I'm saying. If you get, if, if me being 21, 18, 19, I'm having, I'm, I have had sex with men that I didn't, I don't know better. You don't know better. You're allowing a man to, to sell you a dream. You mm-hmm. don't know if what's true, what's not. He's basically saying whatever you need to hear to get in your drawers until you get mm-hmm. a little older and you realize the next guy you go on a date with, this is Cap. I, I'm not going to have sex with him without him really proving that he's trying to be with me. Like she's, she was saying earlier, she's been having sex with this guy with no title. When I got to a certain age, there is no sex with no title. I'm not just laying down with anybody. I'm not shacking up. I'm not playing house. This is the mm-hmm. first man I've ever lived with. This is the per- first man I'm, I'm buying a house with. I'm not playing house with you. You understand mm-hmm. what I'm saying? So there's certain things that you just learn as you get older. Everybody's not going to go through the same learning lessons, obviously. All right, right. let's... Uh... I got a scenario here. We're going to go into a dream world, all right? <laughs> so let's say, right, you go to the Gucci store, right, and you buy a bag, right, and you see that it's on sale, 
right? It could be Gucci, Louis Vuitton, whatever you like. I don't know. Dior. Dior, whatever, you know, right? Whatever, fits. whatever store you like, personally. You go and you get the bag and you get it on sale. It's normally a $2,000 bag. You got it for 1000 bucks. Holy fuck, 50% off. Fucking sick, right? You go, you tell your girl, take a picture of it, send it to her. Look at this bag I just got. Oh my God, girl. And she's like, oh my God, I got that bag too. I paid 700 for it. Whoa, whoa, hold on one second. What? The f <laughs> what? <laughs> and then you tell another friend and they say, oh no, I, I, I paid 500 for it. And you're like, what the fuck? So you're pissed. You go back to that store and you say, what the fuck? People got a discount on this shit. I paid a thousand. I know someone that paid 500. And I know someone that paid 700. This is bullshit. And then while you're there at the store, you see other people buy the bag. Someone pays $10. Someone pays $2,000. Someone gets it for free. Someone gets it for a hundred. You're like, what the fuck is going on? And the salesperson looks you dead in the eye and says, oh no, that's your price. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> How'd that make you feel? <laughs> Mad as fuck. Okay. I'll be pissed, okay. man. I mean, I'll be upset, but I gotta respect it. Okay. Do better research. I guess upset. Not happy. Okay. Not happy. Yeah, I wouldn't be happy. That's exactly how men feel when they have to wait for the box or court you to get sex. That's how men feel about it. So, so explain to me how you can sit there, right, and make someone pay full price for something that other people got for free, got for a dinner here, got for a McChicken here, or someone else paid a thousand here. Like, it's amazing to me how women will sit there, right, and say, I'm worth this. But mm -hmm. you let that nigga fuck for free. <laughs> that, guy, free. that guy took you well, to what McDonald's. When you're that different. guy took you for 555. That guy took you for Komodo. For what locals. the fuck is going on? This is bullshit. But I find it amazing how y'all will sit there and say, well, this is my price now. No. <laughs> I am not going to pay full price you clearance. for a vehicle <laughs> with mileage on it. Yo. Period. Cool. That's but how men look at women. But, okay. Now, what about you, right? Let's Go just ahead. take you for an sure. example. Sure. I meet you somewhere when you were in your... Moving out your mama house. Okay. You you wasn't this guy who was able to. I don't know. I used to live in Miami, so your rent is probably like forty five hundred dollars. I don't know. Something oh, it was like way that. More, okay. Okay. Way more. Maybe, but, but, maybe, yeah. Whatever. Look at what you saying. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now you move out of here. Somebody takes over this building and moves in here and says my rent is way cheaper than yours. Yeah, you're gonna be pissed, but it's the time frame that you got in. Mm -hmm. The building is revamped. Things are redone. Mm. The elevator looks different. There's marble floors now. Oh my God, when I used to live here, the bathrooms weren't this big. Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. Shit changes. Yeah. It and is what it is. The niggas that dated me back then, <laughs> They couldn't even hold a candle to the girl that I am now. Yeah. Yeah, you understand 100%. what I'm saying? They couldn't have the same conversations, and I damn sure wouldn't fall for half of the shit that I fell for then. You yeah. live and you learn. I'm, I, I'm so thankful that God sent me a man that's able to forgive for the mistakes and the unknowledgeable Actions. experiences yeah. that I've had in my life because now I know better. So I would never give to myself to a man that didn't deserve it. I would never just yeah. go off of somebody talking to me and just because they said I was pretty yeah. or they bought me this, I'm going to give up the pussy. You have morals. I can say at one point being a young girl, you don't have no morals, especially you if you don't know no better. Yep. You have to live and you have to learn. Yep. Now, my man already knows what type of woman I am. He already knows that. I have values. I'm not moving but like that. I'm not promiscuous. I'm not that horny anymore either. Like, okay. you understand what I mean? All right. Mm -hmm. You triggered my trap card. <laughs> but if I'm a real estate investor, I'm always going to go with the newer property because I'm able to depreciate it better. Sure. I'm able to get better tax mm -hmm. benefits. But I'm able to go ahead and charge higher rent than the older building. Maybe. The reality is, is this, man. <laughs> Men always want younger, better, firmer, tighter, period. Older women, unfortunately, a lot of the times have more sexual experience, more baggage, more negative experiences and with tighter men. More, more, more negative experiences no. with men, and that goes ahead and gets attributed to me as the man. I want a clean slate that I can work with and mold this woman into what I want. Jeez. Men since the beginning of time have always Yikes. preferred women that have lower sexual notch counts and virgins. There's a reason why. Honey. Because when a woman, <laughs> right, no one wants to be where everyone else has been. And no, God Same forbid pussy. I put a goddamn ring on it yeah. when other guys have paid next to nothing. I can only imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, I'm going to go to New York with some Hennessy and some pizza. Say, yo, trying to chill? 
Bro, like, when I was 18, 20. Now, if yeah. he's saying that now as me as a grown ass woman with actual valuables mm -hmm. and assets, yes, I would feel that way. But the newer building is always going to be better. Yeah, but I yeah. also got that brownstone in Brooklyn that when I first bought it, it was worth, I don't know, 70000 and it's worth two point five now. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, women don't operate like men and appreciate over time. They depreciate over Maybe time. Maybe some, but I don't yeah. know about you. I don't know about you, but the older I get, the finer I get, the richer I get, that is the smarter illusion. I get. That's not right. an illusion. illusion. I mean, I can show you pictures. Okay. I can show you here, stats. Here's, here, okay, no, I'm going to show you a stat right <laughs> now. Too. Men polled all over the world between 18 to 60 years old. Yeah. Guess what they find the most attractive female age group? What? 18 25. to 24. Yeah. Until yeah. they smell their panties and still lingering oh, pissing at no, 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 no. Again, <laughs> men between 18 years old to 60 years old, yeah. when polled, undoubtedly preferred women between 18 to 24 years old. Period. That's what a do you fact. prefer? What do you prefer? I prefer younger women. You prefer how old? How young? So how old are you? Because <laughs> no. yeah. I want to know go. how yeah. old are you? So and then when you're bringing home these 22, 23 year olds, what are you really trying to get from them? Yeah. Peace. Peace. Here's peace? the thing. Peace. Yeah, peace. What I do you mean? She's, crying to, you. she's not that. crying to you about <laughs> real life. She's crying to you about I can't pay my phone bill. I can't pay my car note. I can't put gas in my car. I don't have food in my house. I don't know how oh, to do this. I don't know yeah. how to do this. I don't know how to do that. She barely know how to even make you come from head. Are you a man? No, I'm okay, a woman. So I'm I, telling so, you. Okay, so it doesn't matter what you think because okay. you're not a man. Yeah. Okay, men okay. don't look for the same things that women do. And this is what I laugh at because women think they know what men want, but y'all really have zero clue. You want experience. You want money. You want competence. Guess what I want? I want the opposite. Yeah. I'm supposed to be a strong masculine man who's a leader who could pay for things and take care of a woman. You I need a, a woman that's woman. not going to... No, I don't care about competency. Most And most men don't. It's crazy. Most, most men don't give a shit at all about a woman's competency. What they're more important with is she competent yeah. to follow my lead and be moldable to what I want. Yeah. Men want younger women. I'm 33 years old. I'll be damned if I date a fucking 33-year-old woman. That's a goddamn shame. I wouldn't I date a 33-year-old man either. Ass chick. That's stupid. That's absolutely I wouldn't date stupid. a 33 year old man either. You know why? Because he still wants to play games. He still wants to be outside. Did you not ask mm -hmm. me what men wanted yeah. for a second? And then I'm you're just, bringing it back to what you want. I'm just saying, what are you <laughs> doing with a 25 year old Bruh. woman at 33, sir? He just told yeah. you as what, a man what? he wants that. Wow. That's what you want. Yes. He's not telling you yes. what, what you should That's want. That's what you want. Yes. That's what you want. Did I not say earlier, men between 18 and 60 prefer women between 18 and 24 okay. and found them the most attractive? Okay. Period. Yeah, How ahead. much older is your guy than you? He's 50. And you're 34, so that's yes. a 16 year age difference. Yes. Yeah. Wow. See? <laughs> See? Oh. Yes. What? I'm a, a, surprised you. Do you know what? I'm a, you do you realize you just proved my point for me before? Uh, what I'm saying, if he had no, 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 my point. No, I'm trying to prove a point that at 30, uh, me at 34 is not the girl at 24. Yeah. So I get, I get, I get the age dynamic. I'm not disagreeing that you miss yes, older. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, listen to what I'm saying to you. Older Maturity? men. Older men love younger women. Yes, that is a fact. But when you start talking about what age and and how much younger and when 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 is the age gap start? So what yeah. I'm saying is you being a 21 year old girl dating a 35 year old man, it's a little scary to me because I'm like, she ain't got nothing at 21. She can't bring men nothing to the table. Men don't care about that. Men don't care about that. Okay. <laughs> At 21, yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, know yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. Like, At 21, I'm still learning. I'm telling you, I'm around a lot of younger women. They still don't even really know how to clean their It's, it's right. fine. Um, it's, I'm 21. Oh. You just learned how to clean your right. No, babe. Uh, you're wrong. Yeah, you just yeah. learned how to clean. You're letting wow. niggas in you and you're Taylor. still figuring out That's how to clean your true. pussy no, out maybe right that now. was you. No, but, yeah. I don't know. Yo. You, girls are still shacking up with these uh, niggas. You know nothing about I have my own crib. That's my the, own that you rent. Okay. That you should. That you should. Uh, that you rent. Okay. So you shouldn't. Okay. You shouldn't that you generalize at 20, like that. At 21, oh, your shit, queen. At 21 you're still learning how to exist in the world. Oh, oh, you're you're right. always oh, learning. Oh, at 35, I'm going to still be learning. You yeah. are. Yeah. You are. But you see, at, 20, at, at 34, I'm owning. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? So, my, learning, so I'm, But I'm owning. I'm not I'm not spending $7,000 in rent. I mean, you care about Okay. Yeah. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. My man doesn't care about my money. You know what I'm saying? And uh, nor does any man that I've yo, ever been with okay. care about this my money. Hilarious. So why are you, you arguing for saying? being competent I'm and not, being a but boss I'm saying, But I'm also saying at being 20, now that I'm a 34-year-old woman, I I have to think back when I was 21 dating these these older men. Like, what the fuck did you want from me? But okay, yeah. notice, right? Except for some, some wet mouth and she yeah, called it. Sex, you were doing things that she was not doing. And she's 22, right? 21. Yeah. 20, 21. Most so girls aren't selling. Yeah, they're not. Bro. I like, wasn't selling pussy at 21. 
I'm okay. not saying Maybe you a 22 were, year old selling it. I don't know. Not all, not all young girls. I didn't get it. You didn't have it in a bag. You don't have it in a bag. But not all young girls are dumb. It's simple. Oh, yeah. Make man. better choices. God damn. You know, I love happens. how, I don't know if y'all caught this. She asked me what men want. What the you know, etc. I answered it and then she brought it back to what she wants. Want this. I'm not saying <laughs> she wants this. No, I, I understand that. I'm 34. just saying I just can only think of when I was 21 dating a 33 year old man. What the fuck second. did he want from no, no. me? Yo. Forget yourself for a second. Other people have different experiences. We're yeah, just yeah. saying, generally speaking, a man of means that's 35, 33, whatever that age is, plus 30, he wants peace of mind and clarity. So guess what? Come home from work. Long day, he don't want to hear. Babe, what do you think about this? Nagging, he wants to hear. You know what? Food's on the table. How's your day? And then be so quiet the rest of the time. I don't That's think it. younger women are like that. At I all. don't think so either. I think younger well, women, people I mean, who are we, even well, younger well, than me, are so, thing, so but, much more talkative but, and so much more yeah, self aware. Yeah, we would call And so but, much less yeah. self aware. Hold on, hold yeah. on. But younger women are more coachable, coachable. where you can tell them, look, yeah. I need you to be quiet. Uh, I don't really want to talk right now, whatever. I don't, don't agree. Agree. I don't, I don't, I don't agree you. at you groom all. Them. I don't hold on, hold on, hold on. The younger woman will be like, no, fuck you. Are you a man and you date younger women? What's that? Oh no, obviously then I'm not. Then be quiet. What the fuck? Like yo, <laughs> like, yo, like yo, like how are you gonna tell? How are you gonna tell a guy? Because I'm a old young woman, woman. Okay. and I'm telling you right now. And you're now single, that bitch. I Shut the not... fuck up. Ooh, damn. Like really, like you're single Ooh. and you're telling him something. He's telling you something, yeah. and you keep talking. That's why you're single. Ooh, bro. that's why. Sorry, man. I mean, I'm just saying, like, Ooh. like you're not a man tell okay. dealing with dating younger women, so. That that you're uh, no offense, but your opinion is irrelevant. And I love how all you guys are trying to speak as men should this, men should that. I think men this. Y'all are all wrong. You guys don't know, and the reason why you don't know is because men are rarely honest with women. Because when they do, you say the dumb shit that y'all are saying right now. <laughs> y'all don't know what the fuck you're talking about when it comes to what men want. We want you to be quiet. We don't give a fuck about your job. We don't care about your education. We don't or care money. about you being culture. None of that shit. Or money. We want a girl that's not going to be a whore. Not going to embarrass me when I walk out in public. Not going to yes. dress like a slut, make me look like shit not be a former sex worker we want a girl that's going to be quiet docile feminine submissive follow my program get a dog then because we are people bro <laughs> capable of making mistakes <laughs> repenting later and growing and being different get a dog yeah. if you want someone to follow and listen all the time yeah, my past my past it may condemn your Can past I finish my point? yeah so anyway that's what men typically want in a girl they don't want, like, we don't care about your opinions or how you guys view the world or whatever. Men in general don't care about these things because men and women live vastly oh, different that's lives. So gross. Women live life on easy mode. Men live life on super I, hard mode. I know a lot of men who are married on super hard mode. Great. <laughs> There's a lot of men. I'm not saying I'm a whore, but I know a lot of men who have married girls with an extensive past. And is she that girl now? No. And I'm not going to name any names, but I can name some very, very, and very celebrity, celebrity yeah. couples who have been together last. years. And they ended. They, then they no, end. they're still together. No. Yeah. Some some, but all celebs are rare. But Yo, are this is crazy. Like I'm telling y'all what men in general want, and you guys are arguing with me about what men want. But if you guys told me what women want, I would have argued with you. Yeah, and you said, fine. I want a guy that's competent. I want a guy that makes money. I want a guy that's successful. I want a guy that's leader. I want a guy that can listen to me. I want an intellectual. Yeah, young Have girls you don't get bored hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 stop. <laughs> notice how when you guys said what you want in a man, we didn't say shit. We said cool. That is what women want. Women want competence. They want height. They want income. I wouldn't sh shame you guys for what you wanted. But when I say what I want, why? You why? want a stupid girl? What the you fuck? You want a girl that's just not uncultured, not want? educated? Yeah. She can't Sorry. wipe her clean. Like, dumb shit. Like, why is it that what a man wants is always demonized, but what you guys want, we don't do anything? I would not yes, say that. Earlier, but listen, you literally the, did do that. You, 20, like, came at how? me for saying what I wanted. Like, I told you. I said, I don't look for, like, so, like a bunch of money in a guy. I literally said, like, I want this and that. And <laughs> you were like, no, no, you don't. And then you literally went on in the exact same way. It was Incorrect. Like a mere I said women in general want X, Y, Z. And that might not necessarily be reflecting on what you want. Exactly. The world doesn't necessarily operate on what you think. That's yes. what I said. That's why you asked the, the girls on the panel. And the same applies for you, though, I feel. What? Or I know. 100%. Same applies you for know? you. What? What's the way that the way that you feel, the way that like you're thinking and the argument that you had, like I could say the exact same thing to you. You're not everyone. You're not Bro, every man. You are that, man. one man who wants a woman to be obedient, who wants a woman to listen and tuck her tail between her legs and just be like a good. <laughs> okay, you know puppy, what? How like... about this? We got twenty thousand plus people watching. How about I ask them? Because they're a bunch of dudes watching, right? Yeah. Go okay, for it. and they can actually say what the hell they want to the say. But the guys watching necessary... your podcast are the guys that will obviously agree with you. That's no, the no, reason they're no. on the podcast. They, yo, they hate for us. They hate me. They don't they agree with admire, us. Yeah. I just want to leave your twenty-one-year-old yeah. little chick yeah. in this building for twenty-four hours without you and let her run around this motherfucker. 
That's all I'm saying. And I just want to know she's coming back home at night. <laughs> Leave no, her in the elevator. I don't understand what you're trying to <laughs> what do. I'm she saying. She's going to run wild and do crazy stuff. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Which she doesn't, by the way. Okay. No. Anyway. All right. That's uh, one in the chat. That's yeah, one so, chat. guys, give me a one in the chat if you guys agree with what I'm saying. Give me a two in the chat if you guys agree with uh, the ladies here on what yeah, they're yeah. trying to say. Let's see what they say. Okay. We got two chats. We got YouTube. We got Rumble. Once. Because since girls think that I'm not speaking for men, I am speaking for men. That's why we've been able to build this audience that we have because we're be we're telling y'all what men really want. But women don't want to accept what men want for some odd reason. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. Bunch like, of ones. Let's bunch not of ones. generalize in this table, Habibi. Let's see, we were talking yeah. about what you wanted, not about what men <laughs> only want. Yeah, yeah. some men yeah. like older women. But they agree with me. Yeah, or no, no, women saying, their yeah. age. Because they watch you, you and they're your fans, you and, and they agree with you because you're like one of the only people who like have these opinions publicly and they can like... Publicly. Yeah. Keyword, opinions publicly. Most women can't, most men can't say this stuff publicly yeah, they can. because they get attacked like y'all are doing right now. They get shamed. Cool. We're yeah, doing it's crazy. You know, it's crazy. Oh, wow. See? Dating a guy... I'm not that dating. Like, well, you're, you're smashing a guy <laughs> that believes what we're saying and is telling you to your face the truth, but you can't even realize it. Wait, wait. He, Martin, does, no, he doesn't wait, believe wait, what Martin, you're saying. Did, I'm just saying she that say like, our, he does have opinions that do crazy? combat mine. You know what I'm saying? And there, we've had conversations where like I've listened to him and his point of view and been like, okay, yeah, like I can totally see that. Take, he, away, take away the sex. He's gone. Let's move on. I'm just saying. I'm, saying, I'm, bro, I'm being honest. Bro, I'm being honest. I'm being honest. All right, you know what? I have a headache. Uh, okay, sure. Th and you were you were saying something before? I don't know. You were trying to. You're doing something oh. like this. I don't know. No, Paul wasn't saying anything. We're way past that. Yeah, I'm so okay. right. I thought, I thought we're we got some more here. Girl in the middle walked into the weave shop and said, "Give me the Miss Frizzle." <laughs> <laughs> cost, cost <laughs> he thought he ate. Magic school bus. <laughs> <laughs> Magic school bus. <laughs>